welcome back to my channel tonight i thought i'd show you how i make my overnight oats so first you'll need a half cup measure like this some chocolate spread or you could use some maple syrup um golden syrup jam use anything you like chocolate chips um some milk some rolled oats and a spoon and a mug so what i do first i'm going to put in a tablespoon of chocolate very sticky They just get a kitchen towel. So what I want to do first is just soften it a little. This is just like Nutella, but it's just a shop bought band it blend. It's Aldi's. I think it's one pound nine, one pound ten, something like that. When we're doing that, I'm going to pour in half a cup of milk. I'm not a fresh one, so let's take that off. Like that. Now I'm going to pour in a little bit at a time and just mix around the chocolate. I'll tip it down for you when I have done it so you can see what I mean. You see it really loosen it up. I just find it a lot easier to do it this way. So I'm going to pour in a little bit more. Doesn't really matter if it's lumpy. I just find it a little easier to mix when I put the oats in. It's not perfect, so I will tip the rest of that in there. As you can see, it'd be like more of a yeah, it's a bit difficult to see, guys. I'm sorry, but a bit kind of really, it is still a bit lumpy, like I said. Right, I'm going to wash this cup later. And yes, it's evening, it's 20 past 10 right now. So now that's dry, I can pour in the oats. And just make it level on the top and then I'll just pour them into it I do not have it add any sugar because I find the chocolate spread sweet enough and give it a good mix I thought while well, I'm doing the overnight oats, so I will film it. So, yeah, very late. Well, 
I'll consider it very late for me, but most people probably is. And it just sticks a bit, so I'll just slide it off a little off the spoon. There we go. In the sink along with that. I'll put the lid on the milk because I know how clumsy I am. And that is how I make them. So what I'll do now, I'll get a bag. Uh, I'll get one of these rich freezer bags. One more there like that. There you go, push the handle in, and there you have it, overnight oats ready. Now I'll just pop them into the freezer, and I shall probably need these at 9 o'clock tomorrow, so anywhere from 8 to 10 hours. Well, anywhere from 8 hours, so if you've had them in the fridge for 8 hours, they're good to go. I will pop a picture at one of the corners of the screen to show you what they're like after eight hours. Thanks for watching guys. I'm sorry it's not a face pic <laughs> video. That was what I meant to say. I'll see you again soon. Stay safe, stay, stay sane and keep smiling. Bye everyone.